I found this board at Hobby Lobby. I obviously tried to do something with it and change my mind. I picked this up for $17.99. You can get this for 40% off. And I'm going to start by using my Wise Owl Primer. Even if I didn't have anything on here prior, I would still use the Wise Owl Primer in the white. I'm using a Gen Foam Brush. You can pick these up at any True Value or, um, or Ace Hardware stores. And I'm just making sure I have full coverage. Once fully covered and dried, I grabbed these stickers also from Hobby Lobby. They were $6.99. I know this is a Christmas theme, but you can't get uh, started on this too early. And I didn't want you guys to miss out on the stickers. Uh, they're in the stores now, um, so they may not be getting closer to Christmas. And these are just really pretty. They have a very nice um, detail on them. They're kind of 3D. They have this puffy feel to them. And this particular set had the reindeer. It had snowflakes. And it had these little ornaments that I hung from his antlers. And again, these are just stickers. I believe they're for a window or something to that nature. But I'm going to put them on this board. And once I get everything arranged the way that I'd like to see it, I'm going to put some of these ornaments across the top. And guys, you could do this on any board. It does not have to be this particular one from Hobby Lobby. So once I have everything where I want it, I'm going to now cover everything with the Wise Owl Primer. And as you're going along, if you feel like you see like a little um, space between the sticker and the board, try to get some of this primer in that space. Once done and fully dry, this is what it's going to look like. Now I'm going to add Wise Owl, either one hour enamel or the varnish. And you're just going to do one good coat. And then allow that to dry. Now I'm going to take some water and some black paint and I'm going to cover the entire board. with the black. I did a quick mist on my project before starting to apply the black or you can wet your brush. You just want a little uh, water in there just to help move the paint around. And then you're going to take some baby wipes and you're going to make them nice and flat and you're going to go around and wipe it back. I know some of you have seen me do this before. I allowed that to dry and decided to go and cover it just one more time because I felt like I wanted the deer itself to have a little bit more black around his detail. You just don't want this to get too moist and start lifting up your paint. And again, you want to have your baby wipe nice and flat so it's just brushing across the surface and leaving all the black in the detail. Once that dried, I'm now taking my gilding wax. It's called Eternal. We may have some of this left at chocolateupfancy.com. If not, and if you're interested, I can get you some. And I'm just going to put a little bit on my finger, and I'm going to go around some of the raised detail and 
just apply this little shimmer of gold. I concentrated a lot on the ornaments, the centers of the snowflakes, the design on the uh, reindeer. And like I said, you just put a little on your finger and you just scoot it across that raised area and it'll grab there. It's just a really fun uh, product to work with. And it just brings, you know, your uh, project to another level. You can also get it in silver if you prefer silver over the gold. And this takes about a day or two to fully dry to where when you touch it, it's not going to come back off. And at this point, you're not going to want to put another coat of a varnish or, uh, or the um, one hour enamel on top of this wax because it is a wax base. And our varnish and our one hour enamel is a water base. And there you go. Now you have this cute, uh, nice Christmas themed plaque. And I really hope you enjoyed this video. For other tutorials, go check us out on YouTube. You can now watch all our videos at chalkitupfancy.com. For any paint products, tissue paper transfers, or mesh stencils, chalkitupfancy.com. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.